So it's March 13th. I'm late with my March update, but my hair is, is doing all right. Filming a little late because I'm noticing um, after I wash my hair, it takes a while for it to come back to life with humidity. Usually I um, don't wear anything on my head when I take showers, so it you know gets a little bounce back to it. I'm still using my head and shoulder shampoo. Um, this month, I haven't really been interlocking. I haven't been um, tying as many knots, except for, you know, around the perimeter. Like these, I've, all, I've tied knots in all of them because they keep coming out. And I'm finding a knot is the only way to keep them as locks. And it thickens up after I tie the knot, so I've just been doing that to kind of keep them in the game. Uh, like this one, I tied a knot, and it's it's coming. It's got a little bud at the end. I've got a bud here, so I maintain the buds by twisting them like this. I got a bud here, so I just try to keep them close to the edge right there, and. Um, yeah, I mean the scalp is thick. I can see if I could try to show you. And I'm liking it. I think it looks cute. So I'm really going to stop interlocking. But I got some, you know, that I like. Um, but there's some that are, I've manipulated a little too much. So they have some holes uh, but it's cute I mean my main goal in not knotting and interlocking was to end up um, strengthening the ones in the, the center of my scalp that tends to be the zone where it's I wouldn't say thinner but it's just I don't know maybe it's just something in my head but I um, I'm very cautious to keep the temple area thick just for you know the longevity of the locks that's I think that's the most important you know place in that crown area but um yeah I'm liking it it's getting a little shape I really love it even you know sometimes it has a little shake to it but uh it's looking cool that's that happy March happy women's history month